Hi, I'm Kenny Palomino, a diffusion engineer in a wafer fabrication lab called DMOS 6 at Texas Instruments in Dallas. When I got my bachelor's in mechanical engineering from the University of Texas at El Paso, I knew I wanted to apply my engineering skills that I learned in college to solve real world problems, but I didn't know what that looked like. TI's technology manufacturing group rotation was a cool way to find out. I didn't have a lot of background in semiconductors, but I love the idea of getting to experience different roles and really learn the business. My first role was a CMP or Chemical Mechanical Planarization Engineer. That sounds complicated, but what it means is I learned the processes involved in wafer fabrication and I had ownership of a set of those processes. Since this was my first experience in the fab, I got to see how a factory operates, the different roles including who I supported and who supported me, the overall logistics of fabrication. My job focus was on my process set and how to improve it in terms of cost and wafer yield. Then I had the chance to volunteer for a support assignment in a wafer factory north of Dallas. The lab there didn't use the tool sets we use here in DMOS 6, and I was able to show, share my knowledge and support senior engineers who weren't familiar with the tools. I got to sort of take command and meet a lot of people from the different sides of the business. At the same time, that lab had a different equipment, different process, and different metrics, so I had to get up to speed quickly and contribute in the limited time I was there. At TI, college graduates get to rotate from one module to another within the factory. That gave me a lot of experience working with many different people and different managers. My first mentor showed me the importance of building real relationships within DMOS 6, and I was able to expand on that to building relationships with my counterparts in other factories. When I had just three months to complete a project for another factory, I had those relationships in place to fall back on and help me get the project done. I think working under different management styles is really helpful in career progression. I know it gave me a lot of confidence as an engineer that I could move into a different area and make an impact. I returned to DMOS 6 with different processes and responsibilities. Since I had already learned how the fab worked and where to go when I needed help, I was able to contribute quickly. In my current role, I come in at the beginning of the factory's day shift and I review any issues or problems that happen overnight. Those will take priority. The rest of my day, I focus on my own process and reliability projects and how to improve upon them. I think the main thing people need to know about working at TI is you won't be bored. You have plenty to do and are always finding new ways to do things. I've been able to accomplish a lot and I've also made some mistakes, but I know I always get support from more experienced engineers, managers, and my peers. After work, I usually go to the gym, but one of the surprising things about Dallas is a variety of things to do here especially in the arts community and theater. I can go see a touring Broadway show or attend a community theater play and meet the writers and performers in person. Since I have such a technical job, I'm glad I can be in a city where I can nurture my creative side. And thanks to TI's new employee initiative, I have plenty of friends to go out with. NEI gives you the chance to connect with other new employees and get to know new grads just starting their career. I think the biggest advantage of working at TI is you never have to be stuck in one job. You have complete flexibility in your career. If I want to explore a different role, I don't have to leave the company. I don't have to worry about a manager preventing my progress. I can take full advantage of all that TI has to offer, and that's a lot.